Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. If you are in no contact with your person, this is going to be a general collective reading. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. If you want your own personalized reading, my website is TimelessDivineTarot.com. I do have a 24 to 48 hour turnaround time. Let's take a look and see what is your person's energy when it comes to the no contact situation. Let me go. You deserve all the good things in this world. And right now, I am not in a space to give you the type of connection you deserve. Live your life and let me go. So this person feels like you should let them go because they're not in a place to give you what you want. Your energy is have my kids. I want to have a family with you. I know you'd be an amazing parent and I dream of the day I can experience raising a family together. So you guys are both on clearly opposite spectrums. Your person is feeling like they don't deserve you. They're not in the headspace to be with you. And you are in the headspace of you want to have kids and procreate with this person and spend your life with them. So let's take a look and see. You are in no contact and in separation with this person. So let's take a look and see what is this person's feelings for the collective. Three of Pentacles, King of Wands, and the Star. This person is trying to build something. They're very focused on their career. Maybe they have not really been successful up to this point, and they're being very determined with what they're trying to learn. They're trying to master something. This could be somebody who maybe hasn't finished school and they're trying to finish school, but they do have this drive of looking at their life in the bigger picture. And right now, they maybe you're ready to settle down. You're ready to have a family. You're ready to get married, buy a home. This person is not. This person is really trying to figure out how they can really have this purpose in their life in the long term. Right now, they're really working on gaining that maturity and that perspective of knowing they can't give you what you truly want because you deserve the world. You are somebody who truly is amazing, but this person is not able to accommodate your needs at this point. So let's see what their intentions are. The person you're in no contact with, what are their intentions for the collective? We've got the three of swords in reverse, the three of wands, and the hangman. This is somebody who is really trying to forgive themselves for being so negative about letting you go because they know that you are somebody who's so amazing, but their intentions is to try to move past that pain of what they had to make. It was a difficult decision for them. This is somebody who is trying to progress and prepare themselves for their future. They haven't expand into the future yet, and they're still in the reality of of trying to figure that out. And even though as difficult as it was for them to make this decision, this person is realizing the perspective that they've made. They're sacrificing now for what they want in the future. And that means sacrificing the relationship or the connection they have because they can't give you what you want and deserve right now. So let's see what their next actions are. The person you're in no contact or separation, what are their next actions? The Nine of Wands, the Ace of Swords, and the Ace of Pentacles. This person is really being um, consistent with gaining the truth and clarity of what the truth is. And the truth is that this person did have to cut this relationship out of their life. And that's because they're trying to create this new opportunity when it comes to their life and what they want for their future. This person is not in a prosperous mindset. They're not in a opportunity of being able to give you financially the world that you want. And this person is trying to create those opportunities and they feel like being hooked into a relationship or feeling stuck in a relationship that they can't do that. This person is trying to be very sensible and very mature with the choices they've made. Even though it's been a difficult decision, this person is trying to balance out these feelings and emotions. They're trying to be patient with themselves and finding purpose of why they met you when they did. Because it's one of those situations where it's right person but wrong time in their life. So let's get some advice. What is the advice for the collective during this time period? Strength, King of Swords, and the Chariot. 
collective, you really have to focus on what you are passionate about and find the inner strength to be very clear with what the truth is. You want to get married and have a family with this person, and this person is not able or equipped to be able to give that to you. So you need to be really using your head over your heart. You can love somebody and not have to be in a relationship with them. You need to be very truthful and honest with yourself and be disciplined in being able to understand that this is the departure of this connection, that you may have to seek what the inner truth is and really have the inner willpower to feel determined that you can progress and move forward, that it is great to have been loved by this person, but right now it's not a alignment for both of you. You're both on different pages. And there might be some contemplating that you're doing about, well, if I just wait for them, they'll come around. There might be some soul searching you need to do, but there is some introspection that you need to have when it comes to what the truth is of the situation. Your channeled song is You and I by One Direction. And let's get some positive cards of affirmation for the collective. I trust my intuition, I am brave, and I am genuine. So there is something about you being brave enough to trust your intuition because your intuition is genuinely going to lead you and guide you in the best direction possible for you. Okay, Collective, that is what I have for you. If you do want your own personalized in-depth reading, my website is timelessdivinetarot.com. I do have a 24 to 48 hour turnaround time. Thank you. Bye.